Yes, the beach is packed 24 hours after the tragic accident, the boating accident that killed a woman here on Fort Myers Beach. Now, witnesses who were there Friday watching this all unfold say accidents like this can be avoided. Spring break on Fort Myers Beach. Crowding the sand with people and the water with boats. A scenario just like that of last night turned deadly. Yesterday around sunset, there was a boat stuck probably like 30 or 40 feet out. And uh, there's a guy going around the beach asking people to help him push it out. As boats like these anchored in shallow water, the boat in this accident was stranded in low tide, struggling to get to deeper water. Then a whole bunch of people came from the beach and was trying to get that boat out. There's probably about six guys on the right side and there's a handful of girls in the back. But unlike a car stuck in the mud, witnesses say gunning the engine here didn't help. Some who were asked to help thought twice. My friend and I just decided that it, it wasn't a good cause. It didn't look like it was something we needed to be doing. I didn't really understand why they needed to get out so much. And uh, it, it looked sort of stupid, to be honest, and unsafe. They did that for a while, actually. They did it for a while without anybody behind the boat. But then they were still doing it when a lot of people were around the boat. FWC says one of the people helping to free the boat ended up hitting her head on the boat's propeller. She was pronounced dead later at the hospital. I didn't get super close because it was an image I didn't necessarily want to keep in my mind. But yes, there was lots of blood. It seemed like there were a lot of workers and like um, the ambulance people seemed to get there as quickly as they possibly could. And earlier today, I reached out to FWC about the accident. They tell me it's too early to say what could have been done differently. We're working to find out the name of the victim as FWC continues to investigate. Christina. Yes, they tell me that any boater who might be stranded on a shallow part of the water or on a sandbar uh, like that off of Fort Myers Beach should actually call a, a, a boat towing company uh, to come and pull them out rather than try and have it be pushed out or you for using their engines. So live on Fort Myers Beach, Alex Howard, NBC2.